Hello, I'm again Miss Lena from Mega Plus, a factory of Yakui Group. The use of filler mask bag has increased over the last decade, and especially for PP filler mask bag. PP women already contribute to the lab consumption of filler PP filler mask bag. So, how exactly PP women sector benefits from filler mask bag? Let's find out on this video. PP filler mask bag is a compound of calcium carbonate, PP, and azectic. If you want to know more about filler mask bag, please check this video. Depending on the requirement of PP woven, PP filler mask bag will help to improve the performance of the production, such as increasing productivity, reduce the carbonate footprint, or enhance the properties. And the most important thing is reduce production cost. We all agree with the benefits of PP filler mask bag. So how should you filler mask bag in the most effectively way? To achieve the best result while using filler mask bag, all the manufacturing have to pay a high attention into following criteria. Denier is the measurement which is indicating the thickness of the fabric. This index will give us the clue how many percent of calcium carbonate should we load and the quality of filler mask bag. The thicker it is, the more percent of calcium carbonate we can use. For example, our customer who has a denier very low, less than 700, they only can load around 50% of calcium carbonate. By contract, if they produce the denier above 700, they even can load up to 40%. The extruder speed is a factor that determines the quality of filler mass that you should use. Nowadays, the high speed extruder is most popular in many plastic production because they want to boost up the productivity. For example, our customer in Brazil, they often do a very high speed machine from 420 to even 520. So we have to give them a very good quality of filler mass by with this mark to increase the tensile chain. They can use it without any break and water carry over problem. The first one is temperature. It included heat, cooling and extruder temperature. The temperature of filler mask bag has to be similar with PP, so all ingredients would be totally melt together. Our customer often run the machine from 170 to 270 degrees. You can see here what our customer usually run in their machine. And finally is tensile strength. This index is the maximum material can load when being structured. And there are two main types of PP woven item. The first one is PP woven bag. It is a small bag from 10 to 100 kilograms. The customer often use it for loading PP woven cement bag, rice bag, sugar bag, or animal piece. And this type of bag is often have about 5 kgf. And the second one is jumbo bag. The jumbo bag will has tensile around 10 kgf. The more you load, the lower tensile chain. So we often recommend the customer the dosing rate accordingly to their tensile chain. For example, this PP jam come from our customer factory. They use this one to produce PP woven 25 kg kilograms. This one has 5 kgf and they load even 40% without break. However, with PP woven jumbo bag, you only can support around 10% of filler mass bag to ensure the tensile trend. The use of PP filler mass bag will help PP woven manufacturer not just only reduce production cost but also improve the productivity. With over 20 years experience in producing filler mass bag, Mega Blast has the pride to producing and providing the good quality to many customers all over the world. For example, we have the great W202, which is the best selling in American market, or the great NS2024, which is the best selling in Africa. The most important thing is 
we can customize the quality based on your requirement and it will be matched perfectly with your production. If you want to take a free sample, please contact us. I hope this video is helpful to you and see you in the next videos.